continues to grow in spirit and in fun, thanks to Miss Connie Rance. Uh, there was such a variety of wonderful activities uh, for the Fellowship Missionary Baptist Church seniors. FMBC seniors demonstrate that regardless of age, seasoned Christians can enjoy life, have fun, and support one another. May you all be strengthened by God's power in this new year. Our community engagement is real and worth mentioning. Our engagement continues to be a calling and not a duty in this church. Despite what the enemy might say to us, trying to get us to believe that we impact only ourselves, that is a lie. We impact ourselves and North Side community. Just listen to a few things that we do. Boy Scouts and Girl Scouts, Servant Hands Ministry, helping children at City View School, providing over 250 Thanksgiving baskets, providing uh, Christmas gifts to needy children. This year, 100 children uh, got uh, their needs met. Winter coat giveaway, a uh, winter harvest uh, party, people serving people, backpack giveaway. So we sponsored two non-members to attend our college tour, hosted the Minnesota a state Baptist convention sponsors the debt-free classes for this community as well as our church. Donations on behalf of two cancer, diabetes, and children health research. Foreign mission donations to our motherland, Africa. A provided transportation for National Baptist Convention. Of three free concerts, or four free concerts this year, in the middle of the night on the north side. And we always say thank you. Prison uh, Ministry Writing. Center for Families bringing needed services to the north side that without us would not be so readily available. Health and fitness classes for our own and for others. And I could go on and on and on and on. I'm not bragging. I'm just testifying of what God is doing with this church. Paul writes to the church in 2 Thessalonians, but as for you, do not grow weary in doing good. For if anyone does not obey our word to this epistle, note that person and do not keep company with them that they may be ashamed. Yet, do not count them as enemies, but admonish them as brothers and sisters. We continue to establish a firm spiritual foundation for our youth and children. And somebody else say amen. It is a joy to witness their growth in the word of God. The spiritual seeds which we sow will bear much fruit in our future. I thank you parents, grandparents, and guardians for trusting us with your children. I thank God for the tireless ministry uh, uh, led by Nicole Foster and many others. In terms of our finances, oh praise be to God who brings all the glory. God has brought us from the brink of this desperation to a place of plenty. Thanks to the Board of Trustees, we now have recovered what the locusts have eaten. Our tithes and offerings are at an all-time high. Our bills are all paid. And for that, we say thank you, Jesus. Our very talented and spiritual, I need to say that again, talented and spiritual uh, uh, finance board led by James Burroughs and Alex Rowell will lead us as we renegotiate our loan of $1.8 million this year to the bank. It is my prayer and my hope that Fellowship uh, Fellowship of Baptist Church will move toward being debt free within the next five years while maintaining sufficient cash in the bank. So God be the glory. Please allow me just a few more moments to testify of God's goodness. Uh, some would call it bragging, but just allow me to just testify for a moment. Listen to what we're doing. A thespian ministry, 
uh, uh, led by Chet Gorey and Reverend Pierce, a uh, Sunday school and Bible Institute going live and on the line. Uh, we have a step ministry, a uh, uh, missions ministry, uh, two associate ministers ordained under the Minnesota State Baptist Convention. Uh, Reverend Marilyn Taylor is now one of the, the deans of the Minnesota State Baptist Convention and has been approved to be the dean of the Minnesota State Baptist Convention Sunday School. Uh, there were five new deacons ordained last year. The creation of millennial ministry led by uh, uh, Mary Brunson and Candace Williams. A uh, dance ministry for our children and our youth. Uh, uh, look at God. Uh, we also did a survey this year, a journey to discuss uh, our footprint here on the north side, led by uh, Ned Minor and, and, and Sandra Rowell, uh, uh, Jim, uh, Jim, 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 Jim Patterson, and Dale Johnson. Look at what God has done. Our culinary ministry, when you call them, Stephanie Madsen and her team run into action. Ushers and greeters, they are our first responders in the morning. The face of our, they are the face of our church, the women, non-women, and visitors of the life. Sound technicians uh, ensure that our sound quality uh, each Sunday. Uh, building and maintenance, the snow is removed uh, and cleared. That homes are clean every Sunday. And to that we ought to say thank you. Our social media, uh, leading us through April snowstorms last year on Facebook Live. Countless visitors to our church have found us due to our Facebook page and our web page. Thanks to Sherry Green, Nicole Foster, uh, Mamie Stokes, and, and, and Cliff Reed uh, each Sunday. And I cannot forget our office manager, the cream of my office, Ms. Wilma L. Jordan, who works for this church.
with us as we go forth. God is doing great things with us. We're not the we're not the greatest church in town, but we're one of them. We invite you to accept Jesus Christ as your personal Savior in this church. Put your bucket down right here. In Jesus' name. Those of church over, would you come? Step up to the aisles, come on down front.